So, you know, I'm taking a, uh, a 16 grain bread. I like to get a little healthier with my bread. Shut up. Sorry, the soup's getting angry. Um, I got a tomato basil cream of soup on there right now. Uh, so, one thing my last ex got me into was uh, this different way to make a grilled cheese sandwich. So you get your butter on there, of course, right? Then, like take a little pesto. Now, I don't unfortunately have the greatest pesto right now, but it will do, so shut it. Uh, I don't know why, There's, it just adds some a wicked little flavor into it. And, and you know, typically, I, uh, at this point in time, with my most recent breakup, wouldn't be getting nostalgic quite yet. But I am getting this stuff. Man, anybody else go through a breakup and you get to that point where you're like, you know what, next time I'm never dating somebody like this. And you get that checklist going on and what have you. Um, I started one of those today. I started my checklist. So far, I think I'm down to like, um, I shouldn't date women under 30 and white chicks. And that's where I'm at right now. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I threw the bread on there. Now, I like to grade my cheese. When I'm making a grilled cheese sandwich, I find it melts a little better. And I'm using like a 14 year old aged cheddar. It's really sharp and sasha. So throw that bad boy on there. Oh, that might be too much cheese, but I eat enough salad that it shouldn't matter. Then on top of the cheese, put a little fresh dill just as fun. Yeah, I mean, you can make a boring set. If you got bacon, I recommend doing that as well. But I'm trying to like low key my nitrates, so uh, no bacon for me today. There we go. Got our dill thrown on there. And you know what? Just for fun, let's rip up a little fresh basil. See how that tastes. Ooh la la. Should be good. Yeah, and then you simply slap the other piece on there, like you're not an idiot, you know what I mean? Now, I do got this little fresh tomato basil soup going on. And no, I didn't make it from scratch because I'm cooking for one. If I spent the time to make it from scratch, it would be a waste of time and just a reminder of the fact that now I have all these leftovers as though somebody else was here to eat with me. That was the man to your moment. I hope you're feeling bad about it. I'm not, so don't worry about it. Anyway. So, tearing up some more fresh basil, I'll just toss it in that soup, stir it about. Now, see, here's the crappy part about making these videos, is now things are cooking, and uh, I don't have much to do, right? So, I would do sit here and just, yeah, let's just hang out. Is that what we're doing now? Yeah, maybe. So. Uh, I would have put pesto in the ex's breakfast that I made, but I didn't have any pesto at the time. So, you know, <clears throat> in honor of her, we're going to do it up this way. Now, oh, it's going to be ridiculous. It's actually going a little faster than I thought it would, which is lovely. Um, also, I'm going to take some fresh basil and rip it up and just put it in the bowl that said soup is going in and I saved a little bit of that extra cheddar so I can sprinkle it on top because it's comfort food. It's the Sunday. You got to feel good on a Sunday. So, I don't know. I'm, uh, I was meaning to put more videos out. I was meaning to do it a little quicker, but one, I don't want you to get bored. And two, I'm getting kind of like just, it's been a weird week on the old Branium. So hopefully, oh damn, hopefully next week is better. I know everybody's going so crazy these days. It makes no sense. And then everybody's getting so crazy that, oh yeah, that's all right. I can get behind that. Oh yeah. Let's get that soup of soup in there. And I know it's not a lot of soup, but that's because, uh, Spring is in the air. It's almost bikini season. I can't get into bloat mode. I'm in single mode. Trust me, I'm not going to let this thing slide away until at least somebody's stupid enough to lock it down. So we got a fresh basil in there. We got a sit there. Put a little more chairs. And a 
This bad boy is finished as well. <clears throat> I'm not going to lie, though. Even though people have asked me to make vegan dishes, I kind of have given up on it. Because, uh... <clears throat> Check that out. Ooh, cheese that has that. Because I just, uh, yeah, like I just, I like carcass, man. What can I say? And I have no moral issue whatsoever with it. I mean, you know, that's why I prefer to try to get game and other things like that if I can. So here we got a little, just simple, man. Tomato soup, grilled cheese sandwich. Pale ale. Seems like a good Sunday to me.